Hello everyone, it's Michelle Patterson here with Angel Souls and this is our daily card reading for February 6th, 2020. So we just had this pop out in a weekly and <laughs> this is Fairy Stone Fertility. So we've been working on, you know, getting comfortable with the shadow aspect so we can process. Processing our pain, processing our, you know, experiences. And what this has done is it's given us an opportunity to open up not to fantasy. I mean, that's not a bad thing, but you know, this, this helps you understand your truest human nature to help you understand manifestation. What are you creating? What is your creative life force? The fertility card, yes, can be taken in a very obvious manner where we're talking about <laughs> like actual fertility uh, for some, but that's, I don't think that's the overall message here for today. Obviously not everybody's getting pregnant today. That'd be a little crazy. Uh, but what this is, <laughs> is being fertile with ideas and being fertile with understanding and having this expansiveness where you're tuning in to these frequencies that have always been a part of you, but that have been beyond your imagination or have been beyond, uh, your comprehension, you know? Um, so tuning into those frequencies is now drawing in different experiences but this isn't about experiences as in oh i get a ton of money i mean that could definitely happen or oh, i get that new job okay well that could happen we're in a time where we're supposed to be very uh people focused relationship focused does that mean love not necessarily it just means finding a way to exist in this world in a creative manner right bringing our dreams into realization uh, into the, you know, quote unquote, reality, which is our third dimensional ego consciousness world, right? Uh, bringing that in so that we can have more harmonious interactions with one another. Doesn't that make sense? I think it makes a lot of sense. It's like when we're uncomfortable, right? I was saying, uh, what was it, a couple days ago, you know, I was giving an example, somebody came out and said, you need to work on your shadow aspects. And, <laughs> you know, it was kind of weird because it was like, uh yeah, I know we all do. Like, what would that? Okay. Yeah, I'm not really sure why you came out and said that. Um, so there, there is this sort of fear of being human sometimes. And today we have the chance to open that up and start creating what we really want. And not just living in the challenges, but rather getting into that peaceful state where we're now going to manifest what it is we truly desire. And when we do that, we feel at home within our own skin. We can have more peaceful interactions with one another. And we're not going to feel the need maybe to project so much, um, but rather to let others just find their own way. All right. So we're going to leave it there, guys. I'm sending you so much love and take care. Bye-bye.